Martin Gordon's latest single is called Idiots. It's about Brexit. No surprise then to hear that Gordon, like the majority of his countrymen and women living in Germany, voted Remain. But this former British bassist for iconic 1980s band The Sparks feared the worst before last June's vote, so took preemptive action, mainly, he says, to ensure his son a future here. Uh, when this thing looked like it was going to kick off, um, I thought I'd better um, apply for German nationality because uh, the Germans allow dual nationality for other EU country citizens. Uh, and then in my case, it was complicated by the fact that the small boy would then have two non-EU parents if uh, Britain left. So then at least now he has one EU parent. With Brexit officially triggered on Wednesday, two years of breakup talks will soon get underway with the European Union. Only there will the status of 1.3 million British expatriates living in the EU be decided. About 100,000 of those live in Germany, and it's thought nearly half could, in theory, do what Gordon's done already. Britain and Germany were at war seven decades ago. Today, there's very little sign left of such a bitter rivalry, to the extent where some Britons living here appear to feel torn between the Brexit Britain of their birth and a country increasingly held up as a liberal bastion that they now call home. John Worth's not sure if he'll still be British after Brexit. He hasn't lived here long enough to apply for a passport yet. By the time he can, this pro-EU campaigner could face a difficult choice. So if I were to make that application the day after Brexit happened, then I wouldn't be entitled to, to uh, dual nationality and I would have to give up my British passport in order to get a, a German one. The problem is it's a race against time for me personally. That's my worry. Does Britain leave the European Union first or do I get dual citizenship first? Despite protests last weekend in the UK, there appears to be no turning back now. And for at least some British people in Germany, the price of Britain taking back sovereignty may be their citizenship.